Party leader Martha Karua and embattled Jubilee Party Secretary General Jeremiah Keone now say that, quote, Kenyans are on their own as far as excesses by the Kenya Kwanzaa regime are concerned. The two have expressed their dissatisfaction with Kenya Kwanzaa, giving a status report of the government just two days after Azimio gave a comprehensive scorecard of Kenya Kwanzaa's first year in office. Through the Kamwene Leadership Forum, the two are now giving credence to claims that there could be cracks within Azimio, especially over the opposition's decision to stay put in the talks despite the cost of living going up. Our pol senior political affairs reporter Ibrahim Karanja starts us off. Kioni and Karua through the Kamwene Leadership Forum say the new formation is not in Kenya Kwanzaa but not necessarily in Azimio. We are talking about the KK regime. They have shown Kenyans that Kenyans are on their own and we are reminding Kenyans we are not helpless. So there is a feeling that we are going nowhere, I can tell you. And it is upon KK to prove us wrong. According to Kioni, Kenya Kwanzaa has spited the National Dialogue Committee, seeing as the cost of fuel and by extension the cost of living has gone up, despite it being a key agenda item pushed by Azimio. If I was the leader of Azimio, I want to tell you I will not be walking to those talks. Kindly be woke. Be woke. So that if the KK regime is not serious in these talks, then we should know of our next move. Sources within the Azimio coalition now tell NTV that during last week's crisis meeting, there were attempts to have Azimio pull out or at least suspend the talks due to the Kenya Kwanzaa's continued contempt. While the push to withdraw was largely bought by Karua and Kioni, coalition leader Raila Odinga and Waipa party leader Kalonzo Musioka hashed the proposals, thus choosing to proceed with the talks, a move that may have disappointed the two. The cushioned the increase of fuel last month, the month of August. To me, just to ensure that we were calm when we had foreigners uh, visiting us during the climate change. These are con people. And I am calling upon our dialogue team at Bomas. Please don't be conned. And don't play part of that calling. We will remain in that Bomas place. We are in Azimio. We are not moving from Azimio. But I can tell you, and our Kenya Pia Wajue, Though it is the first time for Karua and Kioni through the Kamwene Leadership Forum to publicly take a position different from that of Azimio, it is seen that the outfit is what Mount Kenya leaders outside government may use to chart their own path. Ibrahim Karanja, NTV.